This is the Meano Gamer Wave Condenser USB Gaming RGB Microphone. Yeah, it's a mouthful. It's actually a small and compact all-in-one easy plug-and-play USB microphone that is designed for gamers and streamers alike that produces some amazing sound quality. And the best part is this mic only costs $35. So in this video, I'm gonna go through and take a look at the build the features and of course the sound quality of this microphone and let you guys know why I think this is potentially a perfect choice for gaming and streaming. Let's get to it. Now, firstly, just to be completely transparent, the awesome folks over at Miano did send this microphone out to me for review purposes. So big thank you to them. But this is not a sponsored video by any means and no money was exchanged at all for the sake of this review video, which simply means all thoughts and opinions that I share with you guys are completely my own. So with that said, let's quickly look at what you can expect to get in the box when you first purchase this microphone. Now, first thing, you'll get the user instruction manual and accessories box that includes a USB-C to USB-A cable that has an adapter or a converter attached that when taken off, turns it to USB-C mic arm stand adapter that you can also use to mount the mic to a boom arm if you want and of course you'll get the microphone itself that already comes with the desk stand attached now in terms of build quality the gamer wave feels surprisingly decently built the microphone and stand feels like it's made with some high quality plastic material with the grill on the attached pop filter feeling more like it's made of some form of metal material its overall lightweight feel, however, doesn't necessarily make this mic feel as if it was cheaply built and seems as though it could probably last a lot longer than you might expect. Now, where the design is concerned with this microphone, I actually quite like it. It has a minimalistic design that I find I much prefer. You can see that the mic is attached to this tiltable desktop stand, a removable pop filter with the Meano logo quite visible, the mic is also shot mounted at four points to help to reduce uh, those vibration noises getting through to the mic from any tapping or knocking on your desk. At the top of the mic are two easy to hit switches that allows you to one, change the nine different RGB lighting modes and to enable or disable noise cancellation and also to mute and unmute the mic with a tiny LED light to indicate whether the mute function is active or not. Now at the base of the microphone is actually an adjustable gain knob that helps you to control the mic's sensitivity to best suit your needs based on your environment, of course. Now there's also a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack at the front of the Gamer Wave mic that you can use for real-time monitoring of your audio. On the back of the microphone, there is a USB-C port allowing you to use the provided cable with the adapter, of course, to connect to pretty much any device that utilizes USB-C or USB-A connections. All right, guys, so just wanted to run through some of these features of the Meano Gamer Wave quickly with you guys. So just a reminder, we have RGB effects, we have mute and unmute, and we also have noise canceling features that are available on this microphone. Now, just to run through the RGB effects, there are nine different effects, as I had mentioned before. So it's just really a tap of the button and you cycle through the different RGB colors until you get back to where you were originally. As I said, this one is my favorite. We have the gain knob button under here. So if I turn it this way, it should affect the audio a bit, right? And if I turn it back that way, uh, you should hear how low I'm getting. So yeah, that's the gain knob on the Gamer Wave microphone. Now, I also want to test the tap to mute feature on this microphone. So it's just a simple. Unmute the mic, you should be hearing me now. So yeah, that's a pretty cool feature to have. And also a really neat one is the noise cancellation 
feature that is available here also. Now, what you normally do, you will hold the button that you press to mute the mic. You will just hold that down for a few seconds and you should get that noise cancelling feature turned on. Now, there's a little LED light right at the front of the microphone that will indicate to you whether or not the noise cancellation feature is active or if the mute feature is also active. So that's a really nice thing to have. Now, we're going to test out the noise cancellation feature quickly. Right now, I am not necessarily recording this in a well-treated room. Uh, I have my air conditioning on. I have my ceiling fan on. Uh, I, of course, have my gaming uh, console on here. So a lot of different things that are going on in the background. So let's see if we actually can tell the difference uh, from when the noise cancellation feature is on versus when it's off. So we're going to test that now. So right now, the noise cancellation feature is turned on. Let me know what you think. Can you tell a difference between when the noise cancellation feature is active? I'm going to switch back to the noise cancellation feature turned off. And now the noise cancellation feature is turned off. So again, let me know what you think about that down in the comment section below. I think it's a pretty neat feature to have on such a budget friendly microphone. But yeah, I guess that's it in terms of the features. So let's get back to the video. Now you can see that the Meano Gamer Wave mic that I've been using here is the white variant but you can actually also get it in other color options such as black and pink. So yeah, you can for sure pick the color that will best suit your setup. So how does the Meano Game Away microphone perform and sound? Well, if you haven't been noticing, you have been listening to my voice throughout this entire video so far from the Game Away microphone with absolutely no post-processing. Now you tell me down in the comments, what do you think of the sound quality that is coming from this mic? For me personally, while testing and using it over the past couple of weeks, I was actually really surprised by the crispness and the clarity of my voice from this microphone. Now, I don't claim to be an audiophile by any means. So if you're one of those folks who are interested in the audio specifications of this microphone, then I'll go ahead and leave that info on the screen right now for you to refer to. But where performance is concerned, I actually love the fact that this mic connects quite seamlessly with my MacBook Pro, which is actually what I'm using right now to record the audio for this video. And if you didn't know by now, I'm also mostly a console gamer and I absolutely love the fact that the Gamer Wave mic seamlessly worked with my PlayStation 5, just a simple plug and play. So essentially, it's compatible with any laptop or desktop computers, whether you're running on Windows or Mac OS and also with most gaming consoles such as the PS4 and the PS5. Now, for some things that I liked about this microphone and some things that I think are not necessarily cons or negatives per se, but more like missed opportunities that you should definitely bear in mind and that perhaps Meano could probably consider as well for their future products. Now, let's begin with things that I loved about the Meano Gamer Wave mic. For one, it's got to be the value that you're getting. I mean, come on, this microphone comes in at $35. It's decently built and you're still getting a couple of accessories, very useful accessories in the box. Secondly are the sound quality and the features that you're getting. Now, is this going to be something that is termed as a sure SM7B killer? Absolutely not. But again, for $35, this thing sounds really amazing. You're not going to find me complaining at all. That's for sure. Now, with features such as noise cancellation, tap to mute, real-time monitoring, a physical control knob. Come on, this mic is actually here to compete. Now, another thing that I actually love is just how simple and easy it is to use. I mean, it is literally just plug and play, no additional software isn't no additional drivers to install, which makes it super versatile with it being able to also connect to almost every device that actually has a USB-A or USB-C port. And thirdly, you can actually be a serious gamer and not like the fact that this thing has RGB with nine different modes. 
just cycle between the different modes to pick the one you like or the one that best suits the vibe you're going for. For me personally, I like the one that I'm using right now, which is the dynamic multicolor gradient effect. But if RGB is not your thing or you find it to be a little bit too distracting, then you can definitely easily turn it off. Just like that. But I actually do prefer the RGB. Uh, yeah, I just absolutely love the fact that you have options. Now, for some of the things that I think that are missed opportunities with this microphone, things that I think can make it, or future microphones for that matter, from Meano, pretty, pretty great. Uh, honestly, there aren't a lot because, again, this mic is only costing you $35. So you can't really complain about too much. But I find that the USB cable that is provided in the box can potentially be a bit too short, especially if your PC's uh, USB ports aren't close enough, which can force you to place the microphone in an kind of an awkward spot or position to record properly and comfortably. I think uh, the length of this USB cable is, I'm guesstimating to be about six feet long. I mean, it's not bad, but uh, something that I found that could potentially be annoying for someone. Now, another minor complaint that I found is actually with the microphone's design. And it's the fact that the desktop stand that comes included is a non-adjustable stand. Now, let me explain. Even though you can tilt the microphone up and down, it would have been really, really great to be able to adjust the mic's height to get the mic a little bit closer to your mouth because that's actually the way to get the best audio quality from pretty much any mic, including this one. So as you can see here for me right now, I actually have the Gamer Wave mic placed on a boom arm that I have in order to get the mic as close to my mouth as possible, which is something a lot of beginners who are normally on a budget may not necessarily want to invest or buy into right now. So with this mic being marketed, so to speak, as an all-in-one super versatile mic, adding an adjustable height could have actually made the experience a little bit better and just the overall user experience way, 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 way better. Either way, for the price, the Meano GamerWave mic provides you with a lot, particularly for anyone that is new to using microphones for gaming, streaming, podcasting, or just general content creation. I don't think any of these things uh, that I've mentioned should ruin your experience, especially for the price that you're gonna be paying for this. I guess essentially what I'm saying is that this is actually a great entry point microphone for all the benefits that I've previously mentioned given its very competitive price. I think it's actually worth every penny and it really doesn't get much better than this. Now check the links down in the description if you want to pick up the Meano Gamer Wave mic for yourself or if you want to find out more details. Now either way, thanks again for stopping by and checking out this quick review, but I'll see you guys again for sure in my next upload.